Have you ever wondered how the Ice Age, a period of severe, relentless cold, might have impacted the verdant plant life on Earth? How did the lush greenery we enjoy today survive, let alone thrive, in such harsh conditions? Picture a world dominated by ice and snow. This was the reality during the Ice Age, a period that spanned millions of years and included several glacial periods. As the glaciers advanced, they encroached upon the habitats of plant communities, forcing them into retreat. However, when the glaciers retreated, it opened up new territories for these resilient plants to colonize. The majority of the Earth's surface during the Ice Age was a vast expanse of tundra. This environment, characterized by low temperatures, short growing seasons, and permanently frozen ground known as permafrost, was home to unique plant species. Hardy grasses, mosses, lichens, and low shrubs, all adapted to withstand the cold and harsh conditions, thrived here. But not all places were inhospitable. There were pockets of land, known as refugia, that provided shelter from the extreme cold. These refugia were likely lush with diverse plant communities, acting as crucial centers for plant survival and dispersal. The glaciers themselves played a crucial role in shaping the plant life of the Ice Age. As they moved, they ground rocks into fine particles, creating what is known as glacial or rock flower. When the glaciers retreated, this nutrient-rich material was left behind, forming fertile soils that were ripe for plant colonization. The plants of the Ice Age were survivors, adapting to the harsh conditions in remarkable ways. They developed features such as small leaves to minimize water loss, deep root systems to access nutrients in the frozen soil, and the ability to reproduce quickly during brief periods of favorable conditions. And let's not forget the role of the megafauna. Large herbivores like mammoths, mastodons, and ground sloths had a significant influence on the plant communities of the Ice Age. Their grazing and browsing behavior not only influenced the distribution and abundance of plant species, but also led to the evolution of plant defenses and adaptations. As the Ice Age came to an end and the world began to warm, plant communities underwent rapid changes. Forests expanded into areas previously covered by ice, while tundra vegetation retreated to higher latitudes and elevations. This warming also facilitated a grand migration of plant species into newly available habitats. It was a period of rapid colonization and dispersal that played a significant role in establishing the modern plant communities and ecosystems we see today. In essence, the Ice Age was a time of significant upheaval for plant life on Earth. It shaped the distribution, diversity, and composition of plant communities in ways we still see reflected in our modern ecosystems. By understanding these past changes, we can gain valuable insights into how plant communities might respond to ongoing and future climate change. If this exploration of the past has piqued your curiosity, do show your support by liking this video subscribing to the channel, and sharing it with others. Together we can delve into the mysteries of our world because remember, knowledge is power.